Hey people, I'm Matt and this is Jonathan. He is new to our group and he hit me up saying, hey, I want to play some shoot 'em ups. Let's do some co op. So I said, sure. What are we playing today? Today we're playing Caladrius Blaze on the PS4. This game is an awesome shoot 'em up. I believe it was originally released on the PS3 and there is now a version on the Switch that you can get as well if you're probably, looking to play. Probably gonna buy it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, uh, you said evolution. Evolution, mode, right? yep. Cool. Two player? You got it. Now let's see if I pick a better character. I think I gotta What do you gotta do to get in? Yeah, I gotta get in. He's playing on an amazing arcade stick, by the way. I'm probably gonna take some pictures and share them I think also. it, it there, yeah, you go. there you go. Cool. Oh, it registers me as player too. That's interesting. <laughs> like I wasn't even I couldn't even go in. I don't know what that was about. Yeah, sure. You can see the ships in like behind their portraits there. Yeah. So you just skip the story. <laughs> All right. I think shoot 'em ups and fighting games are like the only games where you're like, yeah, I don't care, just fight. Yeah. <laughs> like, just... Is, is this the type of game like uh, when you die, you get to choose a different ship? Or no? Um, I think so. You know what I mean? Like other shoot 'em ups, they 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 let you choose a different ship. Yeah, I think I think they do let you okay. choose a different one. Usually when I play at home, I'm I'm like, if I die, yeah. I I don't like to use a continue. I like to beat it on one continue. I feel like it, tough, with man. games that I have unlimited <laughs> continues, uh, you know, it's like you're in the arcade. If you have to put a lot of quarters, like you're not really like yeah. expert level. <laughs> Even though some games are just no, I would I would pour quarters into it. Undeniably, and I, I just want to. My whole impossible. focus is yeah, exactly. My focus is to beat it. Yeah, if I have the money, name. I don't care. I'll I'll throw the money at it. Got to go to an arcade knowing you're gonna spend money. <laughs> yeah, that's true too. Nice. Yeah, this one is better. Get at him. Is there a secret here? Yes, there is. Yeah, some of the power-ups are like hidden, but mm -hmm. like you have to attack a certain portion those, of the stage. Those green, the those green, green things. things. Right? Yeah. Okay, I got a few of them. And some of the uh, upgrades to the weapons. You can upgrade your weapon in between stages, but you have to pick up the upgrades during uh, during the stage. I think this stage has four. Ooh. So I thought I had seen you pick up two at least. So. When we were doing our trial run, I picked up a bunch, <laughs> but I didn't get to see uh, I didn't get to see what they turn into. Go crazy using my specials. Ah, uh, that was one. <laughs> I think we let it just go. Dang, that doesn't help. <laughs> this special I have like crosses wherever my ship is, and I hold it down. That's cool. I haven't played like with all the characters. Uh -huh. I usually play with like the top two. So Yeah, so that's like a gimmick of the game whenever you take damage the clothes sort of rip off of the portrait. You can see on the left side I'm uh Throwing a little pencil there. <laughs> so weird. <laughs> it's, it's pretty funny. Like, a, there's a lot of games that do that. The Senro Kagura games, uh, Bullet Girls. I believe uh, Akiba's Strip. Oh, cool! It does. It does. Let me choose different characters. That's cool. Nice. Hmm. There's also a bomb. Uh, it's one of the trigger buttons. So if you ever wanted to clear the screen of bullets, Ooh. that will be helpful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we both got two ether chips. So. Cool. You could apply the ether chip to the square, the triangle, or the circle special. I usually like to keep everything pretty much even.
Yeah, the bullet patterns later on get pretty crazy. The first and second stage are pretty tame. But like once you get into like the third and fourth stages, it's nearly impossible. <laughs> Looking forward to it. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of the cave shooters on the 360, mm -hmm. like uh, Dodonpachi Resurrection, Mushihima-sama, they are... Like, you really need to concentrate, you need to almost go into like a meditative state to be able to uh, <laughs> dodge everything. So much going on. Yeah, that was one of my specials. That vortex. I've, I've used almost all of my bombs. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot. You that was my huge vortex <laughs> thing. Cool. That cool. kept going off. Ah, oh, this guy. Pokemon. <laughs> yeah. Um, if he touches you, there's some parts where he moves. He's like a huge snake. Mm -hmm. But if he touches you, it's like insta kill. So. Of course. <laughs> Yeah, it's nearly <laughs> oh impossible to dodge. Jeez. The game looks so pretty. Yeah. I don't know, I feel like the patterns of bullets... Like the geometry of them is just so pretty. Yeah, man. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Let's press the start to come back in. So in between, I guess I'll talk. Um, <laughs> you lived in you lived in New York. You lived in the Bronx your whole life. Yeah, um, I went away for four years to Vermont for college. But other than that, I've been here um, my entire life, and I've worked most of after college. I mostly worked in the city, so mm -hmm. have that huge commute down to Lower Manhattan every day. <laughs> yeah, I'm going the opposite way up in the Westchester. <laughs> not not fun either. Either way. Yeah. I think they split them evenly, so. Mm -hmm. Don't care. <laughs> I don't yeah. care. It's like a funny game. I just want to shoot yeah. stuff. Just play. <laughs> That's it. <clears throat> other than other than shoot 'em ups, what uh what other games or what other genres do you like? Oh, I love to play RPGs. Uh, I got into RPGs on the PS1. And uh, first RPG I played was Final Fantasy IX. I've also played... Oh, this is a special bonus stage. Oh, cool. This doesn't uh, occur in the normal one-player mode. Nice. Um, but yeah, so first RPG I played was Final Fantasy IX. After that, uh, Legend of Mana, Chrono Cross. I just fell in love with them and... Uh, Played a lot on the PS2. A lot of RPGs. Let's see who do I want to play with. Red shot. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> the game makes you want to cry <laughs> just because of how, how hard it is. After you play it like a few hundred times, you get to learn the patterns. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and I also like to play uh, fighting games. So I'm a huge fan of the Capcom Fighters, the Versus series. Mm -hmm. um, the Capcom Versus SNK games are like some of my favorite. I gotta, I gotta play more of those. I played, uh, I think I played some of them on the Wii. Was it mm -hmm. I hacked my Wii. Wii has a Tatsunoko versus Capcom too. That's a another right. interesting fighter yeah. uh, versus fighter. I think Delilah had that, or some 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 variant of it, or something. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm dead. <laughs> then you come back in the second stage. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's your portrait in the background, like, dead on top of your ship. That's pretty funny. Aw, <laughs> oh, come on. Just me. Alright. They gave me both of them. I, think you I, thought, I thought I picked one up. Eh, whatever. I don't care. I think you press play and, uh... Yeah. Let's see. There you go. <laughs> I like, I like this character the most. This shot he does is cool. Oh yeah, it has like a slight homing. Yeah, right, exactly. It has its original shape, but then it goes right after the enemies. That character in Caladrius is like a phoenix. Um, they both have like homing abilities with their regular shot. That's cool, I got homing lasers. A freaking laser. That's all we need. Sharks with freaking lasers <laughs> attached to the heads. <laughs> Getting away Ooh. from that mess. Yeah. What is happening? I had now? to shoot off a bomb because that was just like too much. Which button's the bomb? Um, I think it's R2. Okay. I think. Don't quote me. <laughs> ah. Green game's beautiful. Yeah, it does look beautiful. I really enjoy the bullet patterns in these kinds of games. Yeah. There's some uh, shoot 'em ups that have interesting gimmicks. This one has like the three uh, special attacks. Um, mm -hmm. A lot of cave shooters, which are like with insane bullets. The closer you are to the bullets, the more uh, points you get. Oh, okay. So if you're going for high scores, you have to play dangerously, sort of. Yeah. I want to play more shoot 'em ups. I gotta expand. <laughs> well, you have that arcade machine. You could get yeah. a lot of. I'm yeah, pretty yeah, sure yeah. you could get a lot. I have a lot on there. there. I found out about a Blazing Star. Blazing Star is love. Awesome. Blazing Star, man. <laughs> the Lightning Force series. Yeah. Another awesome one. Uh, the Darius series. Yep. If you like fish, <laughs> fish based <laughs> shooters. <laughs> Darius Burst had uh, come out, I think, for the Vita. Mm. And uh, that that game was amazing. You could fight like huge sea dragons and uh, turtles, tortoises, whatever the sea one is. <laughs> Turtle of the sea. Yeah. Of course, I'm gonna run in right into it, running right into the bullets. Come on, we could get the last one. We could get the last one. Okay, the last one. Left this. <laughs> that means the boss is coming. I'd say we can do fighting games, but I will be the first to admit I'm not great at them. Hey, I just I said I play games. I never <laughs> made any claims as to how good I was at them. <laughs> I would get my ass handed to me. I have one good friend, Jonathan, that I play uh, fighting games with, so I haven't really had a lot of practice playing mm -hmm. against other people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mostly we just play the arcade modes. Yeah, the bullet patterns here are really difficult. I'm going back to those. Dude. That was my bomb. <laughs> nice. Here's his lightning and everything. I just shot off my bomb there too. <laughs> Let's just spam and cheese him. 
He doesn't get a chance to shoot bullets. Oh, D, I hate these little guys. These things, yeah, they oh, come wow. after you. <laughs> That's really cool. Come on. I'm here. We only have one more uh, bar for him, so. Oh, yeah, I didn't notice the health on this. Yeah, there's here. like, it's split up into three, so all the bosses. If you're playing on solo mode, uh, you'll be on the left side and the boss's avatar will be on the right and uh, You'll see they're switching their avatars the more uh, You beat them with each segment. There's like a change Oof. Of course that happened why wouldn't that happen? I have like these homing lasers that I haven't been using <laughs> <Sweet>. <laughs> Yeah, there's even a uh, is it a SNK? Uh, shoot him up on the PSP. Mm -hmm. But the weird thing is, I believe it's in tape mode, so you have oh. to hold your PSP that's cool. like this that's cool. to play. Oh, like you know something? Sorry, I, I bumped I, the mic. But that's cool. I I, I I remember playing a couple of games like that on my PSP a long time ago. I just don't mm -hmm. remember what games they were because I would just I would download random games just to try them out, and mm -hmm. if I liked them, I I buy them or. Maybe I wouldn't, but... <laughs> yeah, there's, like, like, a lot of strange Japanese shooters on the on the PSP. One was called a Soryuke Banyanman Portable, and it's sort of like you're a cat, and you're fighting against, like, legions of mice, and you're just, like, <laughs> shooting them down. It's, that sounds it's awesome. It's, like, one of the strangest uh, PSP games. I'll, I'll send you a link to it so you yeah. can, like, <laughs> see what that's about. But, yeah, it's a real fun game. One thing I like about this game is that even though it's a sort of a vertical shooter, the sides of the screen are like that are blocked off that are not part of the game board. Yeah. It's not that that much. A lot of the shoot 'em ups on the PS2 that are vertical, you just have like huge black bars on the sides. Yeah. The same thing with the 360, like or they'll put like a picture there, but like most of the screen is not, you know, playable surface area unless you like mm -hmm. turn your television 90 degrees. Yeah. <laughs> Let's just go crazy. <laughs> but I do when I play these games, I die. Yeah, it's it's one of those things, like unless you've played a game, one of these uh, shoot 'em ups a lot, there's no way you can anticipate the bullet patterns. Yeah. A lot of time when the boss has like homing bullets and stuff, it's nearly impossible. Oh, we got half the butterflies dead. There you go, we got him. And special. I see him. Okay, we were talking earlier about how uh, uh, me, him, and Delilah were talking earlier about how we had like no mutual friends despite growing up in the Bronx and stuff like that. Which was a little weird, but now. <laughs> I'm 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 just about ready to introduce you to like all everybody that we know that lives in the area. Yeah, definitely. I'm I'm out. excited to meet new people. I'm yeah. tired of playing uh, against the computer. <laughs> I'm looking for people who who like to play like versus fighting games too, because yeah. oh we we got we got them. We definitely got them. <laughs> I'm tired of playing multi blood by myself. <laughs> <laughs> Damn! I thought I could shoot that sideways. I'm pretty sure someone in the comments is gonna be like, this is the tellies for how many times you guys died. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I wanted to do that and uh, play the Turtles in Time. Oh yeah. I wanted, that... I wanted to count that up. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was a pretty fun playthrough though, you That's guys. Cool. Me, and, uh, me and my pal Ben, we usually run through that game in like less than 25 minutes. Oh really? I think the world record is like... I... I think it was like 19 or 20 minutes or something like that oh, really but it's like certain certain qualifications to make it like a record or whatever yeah there's but like you can get through it pretty quick on a speedrun.com yeah. like they have a whole list of like for the games that you can speedrun like what even down to like what system you have to play it on and stuff <laughs> Jeez. 
Yeah. Because like sometimes account. emulators, yeah, yeah do it, it a bit faster, yep. Yep. and so it's not the same clock speed as the original systems. Yep. Come on. Two more bombs left. We got like the first, uh, the first. What do you call it? When the thing is split into three. <laughs> the first triad, I guess, <laughs> of, of his HP. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> there you go. Ah! Both of us? We both oh, okay. died. Cool. <laughs> I'm going in. Come on. One thing I really Get like about here. this game is the graphics. Like, yeah. It's definitely what a next gen shoot em up should be. There's a lot of like uh, shoot em ups coming out nowadays that have like the older graphical style. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think this is the way to go. Sometimes, like, shoot em ups that are, like, completely 3D don't look quite right. This is, like, a good balance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In graphics. A lot of people like uh, that square shoot em up on the PS1. What's it called? Not her, guys. Something else. Einhander. Einhander. Okay, I was, think, I was gonna say. <laughs> yeah. I was gonna say Einhander. And I was like, wait, I don't know if that was yeah, the game. That is, I was trying to think of Square games. It's a good game, but I've tried playing it recently. I have it at home. I, I tried putting it in my PS3 and playing it recently, and the graphics sort of tripped me up. I didn't remember it being that blocky before. <laughs> I think you posted a picture of your uh, your PS3. It was the original one, right? One of the originals, the backwards compatible, um, fully. Backwards actually, have uh, the second version. Oh, okay. So yeah. All oh, right, that it's, still played PS One, but it didn't play. Well, all three PS play, uh, PS Threes play PS One, but they don't play PS Two. Right there, you go. But the, the, the first, first one, one does. Yeah, yeah. That, that's it. Yeah, whatever she said. Yeah, actually, I think PS Three is like one of the best way to play PS One games through HDMI, mm -hmm. especially with like with, with the loading Definitely. with yep. games like a uh, Chrono Cross. If you try to like use original PS1 with a frame meister, it changes uh you know between progressive scan and interlace so there's like a pause between like when your screen goes completely black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but if you're playing it on a PS3, it, it doesn't do that so it's a lot better. Those PS3s are uh, I think I have one in my attic that doesn't work. It's going to work in progress for a few years. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> I've been meaning to get to it. It's just happening. I don't think we could destroy these uh Oh, okay. These things coming down. Yeah, I wouldn't mind having a PS3 like that for that exact reason to play PS1 games on. Yeah. Um, yeah. I know they have things like uh, an o like an OSSC. Mm -hmm. I guess that's, that's the next best thing. Yeah. Better, yeah. That, that's the next best thing. I would still prefer that over a frame nice there. Yeah. It's tough because like you have limited play area in this stage. Yeah, 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 for sure. So you you really have to like <laughs> you can't just dodge bullets. You have to like be strategic about where you move your characters. Yeah. I'm learning. You ever play uh, Metal Slug Double X? Double X? No, yeah. I've never played I, that I, one. I know it's been out. It's been out for a long time, but um. I found out about it and saw it was like one day it was five bucks on PS4 digital, so I was like, oh, I gotta have it. <laughs> Those running gun games, though, like the Metal Slug games, Contra, Super Contra, Contra. yeah. Um, I really like Alien Wars. Oh hell yeah! On, on the Super Nintendo yep. Contra Alien Wars. You ever Even play... games like uh, what's it called, uh, Turrican and Super Turrican. Yeah. Using running guns. Play uh, Cuphead. No. No. But. <laughs> That's right up my alley. I love like the bullet hell shooters, yeah. and so Cuphead is like. That's I don't think they came up with a physical it's version. Not, not, yet, not yet. So, so I, yeah. I, 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 uh, I folded and I got it on the Switch because I was trying to wait, but um, the, stu the company that makes it, Studio MDHR, mm -hmm. they said that a physical one is coming in 2020. Oh, really? After the DLC comes out, so it's all in one. Wow. So doing some DLC. That's so cool. That I'm would probably be something gonna to get it because it's too. probably going to yeah. come with like a really cool collector's item. Yeah, that game just like the graphics, Dude. like just the style of that game is so amazing. It's, it reminds me so of uh, what's it called? Uh, Skullgirls. So, okay. graphics wise. Mm -hmm. yeah. 
to get our suspicious back up. Oh, shit. Of course, just right into my ship. And the second <laughs> one went right into yours. There yeah, you go. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that makes sense. Have you ever played Ikaruga? Oh, hell yeah. yeah I love, love that, that game. I have that on the Switch. Um, I had it on GameCube? Yeah, it came out for GameCube. I had it on GameCube years ago, and I got rid of it, and then I, it came out on the Switch. That's coming out physical, too, this year for Switch. Oh, really? Yeah, I did yeah. not know that. Yeah. I found out about it a few weeks ago. I follow all these places on Twitter. That's that's where I go to. When I want to know if a game's coming out physical, I check Twitter. You go on Twitter? <laughs> I check Twitter, I search for the name of the game and physical, and then I, I, see, I see what's going on. Now, I, I find... I use, I use Twitter as a tool in that sense. I get answers quicker than Google. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, bad timing. Yeah, right when he stopped shooting. <laughs> it's all good, though. Oh, right, that wind killed me. Great. Yeah, they're trying to, like, get the play area the, the smaller. Player, right? Yeah, smaller, yeah. I didn't miss that time. A lot of times with, uh, not with this game, but with a lot of shooters, um, moving as little as possible helps not to die. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Just my God. Just if you're, like, trying oh to dodge. Oh, my God, dude. What a special that is. Holy if cow. you use your um, all four buttons at the same time, holy shit! <laughs> I hold down all four buttons at the same time. It's this godlike blast. That's yeah, insane. That's really cool. Wow. I was like, oh, I wonder if I could do three at a time. So I'm doing, I'm doing uh, X square triangle. I was mm -hmm. like, oh, I wonder what happens if I throw a circle in the mix, and that happened. That's cool. Funny. You I think try there. Like, yeah, I think there's. A, <laughs> I think it has to do with how much percent. Each oh, one all is. of them are, yeah. yeah. I, I would imagine if they're all the same, you can do it, yeah. So yeah, it just spawned. All three were at 100. This might be the last stage. <gasps> we'll see. Save the people. Oh no, it's a mission too. It's a special stage. Okay. Oh, okay, cool. Sweet. You ever play uh, Bayonetta? No, no. I have it. I I don't really uh, play games like uh, Devil May Cry or mm -hmm. God of War. Mm -hmm. um, I do like platformers, but I don't like for some reason 3D platformers give me a bit of a headache. Mm. I recently played through one and two. Uh, well, two. Part one I played longer, but uh, I think I have Bayonetta. Did it come out on the PS3? I don't know. I think I, I might have it on the PS3. I know it was out for uh, the Wii and the Wii, uh, the, the Wii U. Mm. Right, the two came out. I think it was like a one and two combo. Um, it may have been just yeah. Hey Google, was Bayonetta released on the PlayStation Three? Special guest is Google on this episode. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. But I have to mute where I say hey, or else if other people have one, it'll trigger it. So I gotta mute it. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah, dude. Because everybody's Google is everybody just gonna be all answering the same time. Whoever watches it is like, oh god damn it. Yeah, exactly. So I gotta make sure I cut that little audio out. <laughs> yeah, on my PS4 I have the uh what do you call it? The eye thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it also has a microphone that you could talk to the PS4. So whenever yeah. I talk about the I have PS4, one in the, in the living room. Yeah. It turns on. Yeah. Like whenever you talk about the PS4, you yeah. just like casually, a little, like <laughs> beep. You the thing will, beep. will come up with the, the little bar at the bottom of the screen. I'm like, no, stop. Like, <laughs> why? It's really funny when I watch Twitch and the Twitch streamer mentions PS4 and I'm like, no, stop. Don't do that, oh, please. okay. <laughs> I wish it was better with like knowing what voice. Yeah. What's coming at it? Where Google knows, like if I speak or if D speaks, it'll know who's talking. Interesting. Um, it'll still trigger it, but it'll know who's talking. But mm. I feel like, you know, for a video game system, it's like, ah, what do you need that for? Right. You know, it should at least know your voice. So yeah. It nowadays, it. they assume you play alone at home and <laughs> online with other people, right. like nobody's next yeah, to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And here You're I like, am. Uh, here I what am trying that? to change that. Yeah. <laughs> what, what is co-op? What? A fighting game that needs co-op? Is this Why? a co-op? You know, the little meme. <laughs> the butterfly. <laughs> nice. Er that 
that would be cool if like we hit something at the same time if it does some sort of like special version of the special you know yeah i know what you mean like if our if our specials could combine like to make like a super special or something yeah. yeah fusion <laughs> yeah exactly there you go <laughs> Yeah, it seems like that, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't either. They sort of <laughs> snuck up on us, those little things. That's funny. They, like, appeared. Oh, yeah. we're finding Gundam now. What? Or mechs or whatever. Yeah. Oh, it's uh, pretty funny. Bomb them. Bomb them out of it. Looks existence. like we're in, like, a castle. But yeah, or I was gonna say, like, a cathedral. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, look, we have guards. There you go. Easy stuff. Wow, your regular shot is really cool. <laughs> I'm trying to stay alive. That homing shot you have is really awesome. Yeah, that's the square. I, I use it constantly though. <laughs> I'm use I'm using it I'm using it like it's a regular attack. Mm. Yeah, the specials in this game they run out little by little, and like mm. you have to wait for them to recharge. Kind of is like prioritizing your strategy. There's a lot of enemies here that's like one hit kills, but then some of them are like more stubborn and you have to use like special to get rid of them before. You want that one up? Oh, that's what that is? Yeah. Oh, sweet. I don't even know. I didn't even know. One ups are useless in this game. Yeah. <laughs> there is no end game, right? You know? There is no game over. I don't think. No, I think it's for points. Ah, uh, so okay. So if you okay, want yeah, like cool. maximum points, you want to collect this many one ups and try to stay alive as long as possible. Cool, cool, cool. I get it. And I guess they only drop you a one-up when you're doing pretty well, you know? Um, yeah. You know what I mean? I believe there's certain enemies that, like, you either have to defeat oh, or yeah, yeah. there's like some kind given. of requirement. Okay. Yeah. Either that or, like, after you come up with a certain number of points, like in Pac-Man, they'll give you a one-up. Right. right, right. <laughs> after you get a certain number of points. Yeah, I think I brought up Bayonetta because the music reminds me a little bit of the uh, music in Bayonetta. I could see that. Yeah. But again, I think a lot of... <laughs> call me out on this one, but I think a lot of Japanese games, the music sounds are the same. Yeah. Them, you know? I can see that. It's either like J-pop <laughs> sort yeah. of inspired rock like music, metal, like Persona, yeah, right, or, or yeah. metal, yeah. yeah. Which I'm all for. I'm a huge metalhead, so I can get down with it. Like, the, I think the, the main menu of this game had some, had like, when I was watching the YouTube video you sent me, Mm -hmm. It had like some riff. I was like, oh wow, that sounds really heavy. <laughs> and I was like, all right, I like it. Um, yeah, that guy, um, Studio Mud Prince, he yeah, does a lot of reviews of uh, shooters. That's cool. Like new shooters, old shooters. Uh -huh. um, he's recently been trying to get through the entire Dreamcast library of shooters, just like review every single shooter on Jeez, the Dreamcast. That's a lot. <laughs> yeah, he's he's gone through the all the American games, and now he has to do the Japanese and the independent releases. So, uh, even the Indies. What was yeah. that one called? Storm something that came out. Stormwind. Stormwind. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah that, that one was cool. really cool. I played that a few years ago. I always wanted it. Yeah, a lot of the uh, the aftermarket games for the, uh, the home Dreamcast were, were actually shooters. So there was there was Stormwind, and then there was Ducks, and then they released like a pink bullets version of Ducks. Like the bullets were pink. Yeah, just to make it easier to see them, because the first ah, version okay, was okay. Uh, yeah. They, uh, Ducks sort of plays like our type, so accessibility enhancements. Right. <laughs> it's exactly. Like a V two upgrade. Yeah. That's cool. Oh. Jeez, fire, really? Fire under that ass. Jeez, where am I? I don't think they let you come back if you... If you if you die on this boss, because it's the final boss. Jeez. Oh, actually, yeah, start. Oh, here Both we go. Of us. There you go. They were okay. waiting for me to die, too. They were like, you can't oh, come oh, back sweet. on your own. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's no way you're getting through this alone. Right? <laughs> what is this? Is yeah, just be in, in between. Oh, God. Ah, I almost... Until the the sword started coming at weird angles. Jeez. Yeah. You sort of have to like memorize the patterns and be in a good position to like. That was my super special. All four buttons. 
Oh, we're, we're both shining. Yeah. I mean, I, that mean? I don't know. Oh, dude, the sword was coming. It almost killed me. Jeez. Is that the final boss? I think, I think it be might be. Sweet. Shame breaker. <laughs> it makes more sense when you can see the portrait is like without clothes, <laughs> with less clothes, <laughs> or with broken clothes. You have been shamed. Shame. We're not defeating them. Actually, we've died so many times, but. <laughs> That's the, that's a lot of story. Wow. Yeah, they try to put the story in there. I don't think it's wow. very like. That was pretty quick. <laughs> yeah, it's a, a lot of these shooters are really fast. Awesome. Probably a lot of fun. I'm definitely gonna. You said it was a. Uh, it's on the Switch. It's on the Switch like, and it's Play on Asia? the physical. Yes, and it's on the PS4 as well, and it's on the PS3. I think the PS4 is a little bit better. The uh -huh. PS3, like if you're playing co-op, has some slowdown. I originally mm -hmm. had that version. I got this one because it was cheaper. Yeah, it's probably gonna cost more than Nintendo tax on the on the Switch, and it probably won't mm -hmm. look anywhere near as good. But I love playing these like when I'm out and about. Yeah. Or like you know, lunch break. Definitely. You can play through this in, in you can play through this like three times in a lunch break. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> you know? it wasn't. It's not. It's not it's that great. long of a game. Yeah. Um, it depends on like what standards you hold yourself to. Like <laughs> if if you're like no. I'm not going to use a continue, then you probably won't get past the second stage, you know? <laughs> yeah, definitely not. Until you force yourself to learn it, so. Yeah. Idle design, my corporation. Oh, that's funny. That's cool. <laughs> Good for them. You now have more stages. Boss rush. Boss rush mode? Yeah, that's just. You want to do cool. a quick boss rush mode? Just like the yeah. five boss. Yeah. Oh, this will be interesting to see, to see how you do. Solo. Um, yeah. Solo. Death. Nice, you got his first form uh, down. So the boss's uh, character is on the left. And each boss has like a different uh, anime oh God, type avatar. Has a what? Each boss has like a different, uh, you know, anime-looking uh -huh. avatar. Yeah, a lot of times, once you're in a good spot, you stop moving. <laughs> you know, the bullets just go right by you. But if you move to try to dodge, you run into something. Nice. That was bad. <laughs> You got him. Let's see how far you can go with the boss rush <laughs> until they're like, nope. Oh yeah. Run out of continues or whatever. Oh, okay, so it just second flows one. right into yep. the second level. Ah, that's cool. I feel like I'm not shooting anything. I'm looking at the bottom. Oh, wow. Oh, that's it. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I'm so just looking at the bottom trying to dodge the bullets. That's cool. That's cool, that's cool, that's cool. I can get down with that. That's really cool. It's actually really awesome. <laughs> so it looks like there's five, six, seven bosses. We're gonna wrap this one up. We're gonna find something else to play. Definitely. It was a lot of fun, bro. <laughs> Hell yeah. I lo love you. <laughs> Yeah.